One of the hardest parts of dental photography and one which is the most important is Accurate colour reproduction is extremely important in dental photography, so I can set up my exposure settings for intraoral photography and store them as a preset under custom one. So what do softboxes actually do and, and when would you need to have control over light angle? You could do a close up and the flash will not light that background, it will just light the subject itself. This is a standard dental photography retraction and mirror kit that I use, contained within a dedicated low profile aluminium tray. And this step is obviously repeated when you're taking pictures from the other side. You need to be able to take a picture using the same settings from the same perspective over a period of time. A black background is commonly used to create a clean background. Too often I see before and after results which have a clear inaccuracy in the colour reproduction. I'd recommend retracting for them first and then asking them to hold the retractor rather than handing them a retractors and trying to guide them.